everyone. This is Susan Givens. I'm the publisher of Auto Success, and we have a special guest with us today for our Dealer Insider. We have Idalis Maldonado of Hello Mazda San Diego. How are you doing? I am doing wonderful, Susan. So I want to get back. I want to get into your background and where you are and and all that good stuff. But but first, how did you get into the automotive industry? Oh my gosh, I was in autos. I was in the auto industry since uh, I was in high school. I was a file clerk. So I started many, many, many years ago. I only count, you know, actual like finance manager on. So, so far 15 years in the industry, um, if you don't include file clerk and, and BDC and all the other fun opportunities that you have within a dealership, right? Um, so yeah, I just literally came on board as a file clerk. And then a few years later after college and after being in real estate for a couple of years, um, I was recruited by a dealership in Bloomington, Minnesota, and they recruited me to be a finance manager. So that's where it all started. All right. Well, the weather's probably a little better in San Diego right now than Minnesota. Oh, but... yeah. <laughs> so one of like the big topics we have at Auto Success, we actually dedicate an entire month to women in auto. Um, you know, this has been a male driven industry until really recently. And, you know, there's tons of women in this industry now really making an imprint. How how have you made your imprint in this industry being a woman? You know, I think I like to say that I'm just a realist, right? So I I don't change my core values for the industry just because I feel like that's what makes me unique in the industry is I'm I'm more of a feeler, uh, not a feeler, but like a an emotion driven individual. So to me, I like to just really work from the ground up if 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 I'm on the ground and I'm asking someone to, to do a certain process or go a certain way or do something, you know, that's out of the box, I always want to be able to do it first to then say, okay, this is possible. We can do it. Let me show you how, and let's do it together. Right? So I've always been that type of a, of a coach or a mentor for, for my staff from the beginning, all the way on up to, to GM. So I think that that's what makes the woman side of me just a little bit better than than the average industry right that's awesome that's awesome how is your business model i know it's a little different than a regular business model how are you different at hello mazda than maybe some of your competitors or, or different dealerships in the industry great question um we are totally different um we are uh we are best price up front. We don't, you know, hand you off from person to person during your experience here. We always greet you with the best hello, right? We want to give you our best price up front. We want you to grow relationships with the sales consultant that you choose to work with and to have them take you all the way through A through Z, um, your process. So we don't have a finance office. We basically have the sales consultant show you the car, sell you the car. You know, you find the one that fits your your lifestyle and they just do the full transaction all the way through and through. I love that. And that helps build rapport with your salesperson for later on when you're ready to buy another car. Absolutely. So, so for our audience, here's the kicker. Hello Mazda has been in business for about a month. Um, they've had, they are moving to this new location. They have cars on the lot, but they're, they're doing a great job. How, how's it been going? Tell us about it. It's been going wonderful. Um, we, we had a great start. We started on Valentine's day and we literally have, have, have been overran for the most part, just because not so much that we are there's so many clients coming in the door, but there's growing pains, right? We are running out of a mini golf uh, establishment and we're trying to run a full blown dealership out of it. But as far as like business and, and how Hello has done in the first two to three weeks, um, it's been awesome. If anybody's curious on what Hello Mazda is gonna look like, you can get on their website and get a little sneak peek. It's pretty cool. Um, also, before you got started, was there hesitation? I know, you know, we've had COVID, we've had inventory issues, we've had, you know, just staffing all, all around. 
what what made you just continue to move forward? So Hello Automotive Group did open up in 2019 um, out of our Valencia and Santa Clarita stores um, before the San Diego store. We, we took on the San Diego store. So, um, you know, COVID was hard for the industry all the way around. Um, we literally just, we had to meet people where they were at, right? From the beginning, um, from when we had to shut down dealerships or not even shut them down because people were wanting service still on their vehicles. Some people were still commuting and things like that. So we just really met them where they were at. It seems like you guys really just kind of moved forward. You got the customers what they wanted and you did it with, you know, integrity and you get smile on your face. So, yes. um, so I cannot wait to see you guys thrive this year. What are your goals for 2022 in your first year of business? You know, it's so hard to really gauge, right? Because we, we're, we're getting started at the beginning of a year, but in all reality, with how cars are being distributed and, and all the different aspects of how um, the industry works, um, we're striving to to be number one, but at that point, we don't know what that is yet, right? So um, we're definitely striving to to sell cars and and take care of clients and, and assuring that we 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 get to our numbers that we strive to be at. That's perfect. So so I have a plan, and I kind of talked to you a little bit before this offline, but I want to redo our interview this time next year and see where you where you are i think that we're gonna all see some exciting things at the dealership and maybe we can even like play a video of of what the new facility will look like how's that sound absolutely that sounds awesome um i know that we are currently going to be videotaping as the the building gets going so from the demolishment stage all the way through to when it's being built and going up Uh, We'll be working out of trailers in about six months. So you'll be able to see all the transition uh, through, through the, through the website, I believe is where we're going to be launching it. So it'll be awesome to see uh, how it all turns out in the end. We're so excited about the new building just because it's going to be brand new. It's going to look gorgeous. um, And, you know, it's going to be top notch. (laughs) That's great. That's great. Well, I appreciate your time today, Dallas, and thank you so much. We love what you're doing with your dealership and just being so positive in in our automotive industry. Um, Thank you guys so much. Thanks to our audience for listening. Have a great afternoon. Thank you. Thank you. Have a good day.